Hello guys, today I'll be unboxing and reviewing this Inflight 500 British Airways Boeing 747-400 in the current Union Jack livery. I bought it from Grey Line Station, a Chicago based hobby shop via eBay for $24 plus $5 in shipping, totaling it to $29. This is my very first in-flight 500 model that I bought for my model, uh, sorry, model commercial aircraft collection as well as my second 1500 scale model after the Star Jets Northwest 727 in 1500 scale and the second British Airways model after the Gemini Jets British Airways Concorde in the previous unboxing and review video which is also in part of a YouTube video request as I also mentioned that I may do a British Airways 747 model review in which I'm doing right now. If you haven't checked out my Northwest Orient 727 uh, unboxing video or my British Airways Concorde unboxing video, please check check out my channel. So before I review this model, let me show you the box cover. It shows you the model inside. Here's the British Airways logo on the side, the top. The British Airways logo again on the side and the specifications of this aircraft. Feel free to pause this video and when you're done, resume playing. And here's the back uh, of the box. This aircraft, in particular, is registered as Golf Dash. Charlie India Victor Bravo and this is the normal um, Union Jack delivery as you can see here all right let's unbox this model Here's the model. Box sign. Now I'll start reviewing. Let me show you the model. Three sixty. Alright, let's start in the front. Here you have your uh, cockpit windshield as well as your windshield wipers. Your cockpit escape door on the upper deck near the, near the cockpit. Your pedo tube. You have your cutaway markings located throughout the aircraft as well as door markings. Yeah, this is your this is the registration. Again, you, this is your Union Jack um, logo on the tail, as well as the last two of the registration. Going back to the front, we have the British Airways logo, along with the One World logo on the main door. Landing lights. From detail on the wing, probably down the slats in particular. This aircraft is powered by four Rolls Royce engines. You should nav light and winglet. I should have mentioned this earlier, but here's your strobe light on top. Let's look at the other side. Same as always, from the left, lane lights, chrome slats, and your nav light and winglet. Now as for the right uh, side of the fuselage, your pito, toe 
same detail as always except you have your cargo compartment door on the front and the rear they don't have much detail on the cargo door as much as on the uh, on passenger doors you see Union Jack on the tail again. Use your horizontal uh, stabilizer detail. As well. And you have your APU. Once again, let me look at the t wings. Awesome detail. Now let's look in front. Engine fan blades are chrome or silver. Use your nose gear is kind of crooked. And there's your, on both sides, your last two letters of the, of the registration. And probably the crooked nose gear. None of the gears do roll. Here's your nose gear. In flight 500 logo. And uh, and your gear doors on the main gear doors. Now the main gears they do not uh, tilt except the, for the um, aft uh, two, they tilt by, with the whole uh, gear, but not by the base of it, as you can see. So, other than that, here's your left wing. Sorry, this is the right wing the, on the bottom side. And here's your left wing with the registration I have one more thing to show you before I wrap up this review video here's the your north here's the northwest orient 727 from star jets here's the size Compared to size and by curiosity, out of curiosity. This 747 is huge, really huge. Now, as for the undercarriage of this uh, 747, it's not as much detailed. Like Gemini jets, and but other than that, majority is of the aircraft is really much detail. So that's the end of the video. Be sure to stay tuned on some more unboxing videos of my, my aircraft collection, as well as any takeoff and landing videos of various commercial aircraft. Thanks for watching. Please like this bit, uh, review video, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And happy and safe flights to all.